This is a very retro looking. Okay. I told myself that I would flush. Put clothes away. Get in. Hawar. Press space bar to shower. I'm gonna shower. Yeah, I love the water. Especially hot water. But Wonder why I don't have any curtains for my shower. Wouldn't the water just go everywhere? Okay. Okay, is there somebody that's gonna come after me if I do this for too long? My God, why, yeah. <laughs> you f- As much you fear that's manifested. <laughs> oh god, okay. Nope, no more of that one. Okay. Looks like I'm just going straight. Okay, what am I supposed to be finding here, as a matter of fact? Is this going to be like another short game and then in the end it like has a jump scare into it? I hope not. So you turn the lights off. What? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Why would you turn off the lights? Unless if that's like your job or something. Not seeing two cars together in the exact same aisle. This is a little, a little spooky. It's kind of weird that I can't steer with my mouse. Reserve. Okay, good door. Yes, door. Here you go down. Okay. Wait, that's it? Is that all there is to this game? Oh, great. Same thing. Anyway, if I can go any faster. There's no way for me to go faster, is there? I'm such a bad luck, am I? Every time I go near a light bulb, it bursts.
What's that white in the distance? Like dots of white. Oh god, it moved. Or maybe that was just some kind of a glitch. Probably a minor glitch. Okay. Turn off lights. Okay, going back down through a dark hallway once again. This is always the most intensifying type of type of type of stuff. What the hell? Okay, why did that sound like somebody was running? There not be nobody running. You better settle down. Settle down now. Oh, there we go. Oh. Okay. Cool. Okay, that was freaky. How come it didn't work the first time? Um. Looks like. Oh god, yeah, there was somebody in front of me. I thought that was just some kind of a minor glitch, but no, that was a... That was a person, I think. Don't play me dirty now. Don't you go jump scaring me. I just came here. Turn off some lights. If you... Okay, I don't remember cars being here. Yeah, I really don't remember cars being <laughs> Oh, I don't remember a guy running after me being there. Oh, God, okay, yeah, there was somebody after me. How does he move cars, though? That's the question. I really wish there was a way where I could go a little faster. Yeah. Oh, 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 no, you don't. No, you don't. Okay, please tell me I can get out of here after this. What the hell? Okay. Where is this place now? Is this hell? Do we work for hell? Like, is this like... Some kind of long, bloody looking hallway? What the hell? Oh god, this is another one of these games where I'm the villain. In secret. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh!
Okay. Well, that looks normal enough. Okay, now this kind of looks normal. Kind of. Except the only fact is that the um, all the cars, they look exactly the same. Unless if that's how the game has been built. That was some very interesting, disturbing kind of stuff. Okay. Run. Oh shit! Okay, run, run, run. Okay, we finally get to run now? Okay, yeah, we finally get to run. Let's just run. Go, 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 go. God! Dang, these games today in 2024 are really, really heavy jumping off my chair. WASD to walk, shift to run, C to switch camera. Oh, okay. I can switch to like third person to. Oh, well, that's cool. That's it's definitely kind of reminds me of like Resident Evil. Oh. Uh. Okay. So that was pretty much like a. Uh, Guessing like the prologue or something. I better get ready to meet up with Noah and go camping. I need to grab the backpack and as a precaution, a lighter in case we decide to make a campfire. It's actually not a bad idea at all. Huh. Yeah, that's kind of this is all. Okay, there we go. I had no idea where to go. Grabbing backpack. Hmm. I think I got everything. I still need to find a liar, but oh. is that what that is? Leave the house. Okay. There we go. Okay. So I was just grabbing the backpack and liar and now me and my friend we're gonna go camping. Yeah. This is some 1980s horror movie stuff right here. Okay. Very, uh, very pumping up like intro. Hey Noah, excited for this adventure in the forest. Absolutely Jackson, this getaway is going to be the best. Nothing like a good dose of nature to escape the everyday chaos. Totally agree. Hey. I heard this forest has strange stories. Legends of things that roam at night. Ah, you know how those stories go. Just legends to add more excitement to the experience. It won't be anything major. Just two guys enjoying the outdoors. I hope you're right. But seriously, what would you do if we encountered something bizarre out there? Ha <laughs> ha! Man, if I saw something strange, I'd run faster than a scared squirrel. But on a serious note, 
Don't worry, we'll be fine. Yeah, it's yeah, just yeah, a camping yeah, trip. Yeah, yeah, Nothing yeah, major yeah, is going yeah, to happen. You always manage to yeah, reassure yeah, me, Noel. Yeah, yeah. Let's make the most of the night. All right. All right. Okay, obviously that's the bad guy. Because if you see a different vehicle and it does that do do, and then that's the uh, that's usually the bad guy. Whispering Woods. We've arrived. Yeah. Well, let's get to it. How about this, Jackson? We set up the tent, and I'll go gather some wood for the campfire. What do you think? All right. I'll start setting up the tent. Okay, setting up the tent. Okay. And spins it up. Okay. Anything else besides the tent we need to set up? Okay, obviously the backpack. Retrieve the lantern from the car. Okay. And the lantern. Explore the map and wait for Noah. Okay. Boy, I forgot I could still run. So hopefully my friend is okay out there. Okay. Okay, this is weird. What is this? A graveyard? <laughs> what is this? A graveyard? Of course it's a graveyard. See, Macabre Discovery and Whispering Woods Cemetery. Date, September 19th, 1982. A tranquility, a peaceful whispering wood forest was once again disrupted by the sinister discovery when a body was found in the local cemetery. Residents who frequently, who frequent the forest for outdoor activities and visit cemetery are perplexed by the disturbing event. Details are still scarce, but initial reports indicate that the uh, passerby discovered the body during the morning, a morning walk through the cemetery. Authorities were immediately alerted as they are conducting a thorough investigation to determine the victim's identity as well as the circumstances that led to this anonymous discovery. Okay. Cool. Okay. I didn't want to like go through a bunch of bunch of words there because I've already got the yeah I already got the detail of uh of what's going on. It seems like there seems like there's some death going on out here. Oh, 
Oh, thank God Noah's back. Noah, what's going on, buddy? Hey, Jackson, I brought the firewood. Let's set up the campfire. It's getting late. <laughs> okay, we'll set up fire because it's getting late. To light the campfire. I brought a lighter. It's in the car. I'll go get it. Okay. There we go. Man, nothing like the warmth of a good campfire to ward off any weird feelings in the forest. I agree, Noah. Sometimes it's good to escape the urban routine and enjoy nature. So speaking of which, how about telling some spooky stories? They say it's a camping tradition. Oh, absolutely. Let's do it. I have one to start. Ever heard of the local legend of the Silent Trail Ghost? Hmm. No, I haven't. What's that story? They say, many years ago, a lone traveller got lost in this forest. He walked a narrow trail, but was never seen again. They say now, at night, you can hear his silent footsteps wandering through the forest, as if still searching for his way home. Well, I've never seen anything that couldn't be explained. But there's always something eerie about this forest, don't you think? Sometimes, imagination plays tricks on us. But hey, we're here to have fun. No ghosts are going to spoil our night. I agree, Noah. No legend will stop us from enjoying this getaway. Okay. Long time passed and Jackson and Noah talked for hours. Yeah, it seems like... Uh, Seems like those guys are very good talking for a long time with a very distinct kind of dialogue. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep too. I'm exhausted. All right. Good night, Noah. Good night, Jackson. A few hours later. I'd better wake up Noah. <laughs> I better wake up Noah. Huh. Here. What is he? Okay. Noah. Noah, buddy. Okay. Oh, good. This is another side of the campsite. It's locked. Okay, good. Wait. Okay. I'm guessing we're going to go back this way. I did see a, um, I saw a building earlier near the cemetery and I think that's where Noah would probably be at. Oh, this is very, uh, very unsettling type of situation probably more than just a situation probably more of a hunting hour if you ask me
Okay. Now this is worrying me. Okay, cool. Okay, no Noah in sight. This is definitely managing to weird me out a little. Okay. Can't leave. Where is he? There like another road over here? Or? If I was a guy who would kidnap somebody and want to hide them somewhere where nobody could find them, where would I be going? Oh, I think I missed one. See, a shocking turn of events, this and this and uh, Siren, whispering wood forest, known its for its tranquility, has became the stage of a mysterious incident. Authorities were alerted after discovery of disturbing evidence suggesting a possible murder deep within the forest. Okay. This is not freaky at all. God, man.